Welcome to Contemporary Art History 312. Today we're going to talk about Yves Klein, but it's not really Klein, but it's French, so I've probably butchered it, but that's close enough. His dates are 1928 to 1962, and he was concerned with uh, uh, performance art or nouveau riche uh, art, and so um, he really liked blue a lot. So um, I'm going to talk a little bit about him and then I'll show you some of his work. He had a black belt in judo and he opened his own studio in 1955. Uh, he actually covered a whole canvas with uh, ultramarine blue and he said that this blue color embodied unity, serenity, and he said it was the liberation of his spirit. He liked these flat colors because it didn't show uh, there was no artist's hand in it, and uh, he sounded to me from the research that I've done that he was kind of um, uh, kind of an odd guy. The, the, the uh, illustration in the book, I think, is the leap of void, and it shows uh, uh, Eve leaping out of a window, and he was very interested in levitation. He was uh, obsessed with flight and levitation. He also, as I said before, he loved this blue color. So he, what he would do, as you can see in the picture here, he would cover live models with just blue paint, and then he would just do um, an imprint of their bodies, and that would be um, uh, the painting. He also experimented with rain on canvas and to see what that would happen. So um, that is kind of uh, Eve Klein. And the other thing he did too is sometimes he used actual flames to burn some of his canvases so they would look charred. So what we're going to do in our referential work is we're going to do an Eve Klein. And what we did in the last time I taught this class is some students painted their, they, they used um, someone else in the class as their painting medium. So they would take uh, each other's hands and then paint them blue, and then take the hand, and then paint the canvas to create their own um, Eve Klein. Here is one where one student dipped another student's hair in blue paint and also um, painted it that way. Now, um, Eve Klein, what he did is he actually took nude models and then painted them blue. But because we're in um, a classroom um, here, it's probably not the best idea to, to, do, to use uh, nude models to, uh, for a whole body art. But you certainly can use someone else's foot or whatever extremity they will allow you to use. So what I want you to do is find a partner or find someone who you can work with, paint them blue, and then create your original Eve Klein. Have fun with this project. Um, it should be a hoot. Thank you for your attention.